What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Looking at My Big Tarot, here where I bring you the beauty juice and spiritual truth. I'm your spirit guide host, Miss DC, and today, you guys, we are back with another general reading for the collective. Please understand this will not apply to every single individual, as every single individual is not going through the same scenario. Cross watchers, anybody who this video is for, cross watching for you, you're more than welcome to join in, tune in. But please utilize this information for its most positive purpose. Spirit told me to talk to you, so I will be talking to you guys with a few of my tarot decks. For more information, everything will be in the description box below. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe to this video. And if this is so, drop a tip in my cash app, leave a comment, and let me know. Without further ado, collective, I am talking to you. Have for the collective volcano so i feel like something is going to be erupting something may be about to erupt somebody might be going to hawaii i feel like something i feel like an outburst or something is about to pop i feel like something is about to like pop off be careful a soda bottles a soda bottle top might just fly the fuck off yeah, something, food, somewhere where there's food and drinks. Macaroni and cheese might be significant. Maybe the cheese is popping or something is too hot. Maybe it's spicy. Something exploding. You see how the food is just kind of like laid out all over the place, like a food explosion or somebody dropping some food all, all over the place. Yeah, crazy pattern. Somebody done dropped some food somewhere or the food was too hot. Maybe it popped up and like, you know, when you go to somewhere like Fridays and they bring out that, um, that uh, cat, cast iron skillet and it's, and it's, sizzling and popping and when they set it down it's like popping up in front of you that's what I kind of get like if you were to go to get um a, a sizzling plate like a sizzling plate I feel like somebody is making some food but the food sizzles or it drops or something along that nature so if you're planning on making food be careful because it may pop up or it might be too hot you spill it I just had some macaroni and cheese today. Yeah, king of wands. So somebody around you is just like really, really bossy. Um, somebody who's real pushy, just kind of like, come on, get it done, get it done, hurry up. Somebody who just likes to rush um, might be around you. It might be aggravating. Somebody might just blow a fuse for nothing. It's like, or somebody might, somebody is just very much hot tempered. I feel like somebody is very much hot, hot tempered. Maybe I feel like this person could possibly cook. Somebody's mad at an empress or somebody is mad. So you got two people here who somebody is unnurturing because they're very volatile. But I feel like both of you are very volatile, maybe the feminine more than the masculine. I feel like the feminine is more of a, will pop the fuck off at you. The other person, the masculine energy, this person is mean too, but the feminine is a little bit more mean, like a little bit more nasty with it. Like this person can say something that will pop the shit out of you and they're coming in fast or somebody might be coming in fast to say something to them or to express something. I feel like somebody might be coming in. It's like if you got a, a man and a, a woman arguing, somebody else wants to run in and stop the argument or somebody wants to come in and defend someone else. 
slowly but surely i feel like somebody is like slowly but surely waiting to move in on this empress because they see that somebody else is treating them wrong so this king of wands might be treating this empress wrong and it be and it might make the feminine very volatile. So this person may not even really be somebody who's volatile or somebody who's, you know, aggressive, but when feeling like, you know, everything is coming to the surface, they just explode. And I feel like somebody else sees that and is like, well, let me come in and help her or help him. It could have, it could be a man as well. But let me just come in and help because I feel like whoever this is doing this to her. Yeah, I feel like whoever this King of Wands is, and it could be a fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, because we got heavy fire here. Um, somebody is just like this person, whoever this person is, they're very, very argumentative. Somebody here is very, very argumentative. And they just maybe they start conflict maybe i feel like this person is probably this masculine energy is probably arguing with a lot of people so this possible fire sign doesn't have to be it seems like they're arguing with multiple people and the feminine energy is one of them and the feminine energy is like well shit, you really shouldn't be arguing with me you should be arguing with them but now the feminine energy is getting very volatile and maybe needs to eat or or maybe get so mad they spill their food or um maybe they eat maybe this person eats their food really hot but i feel like somebody else may slowly but surely become moving in towards whoever this empress is i feel like somebody wants to fix them but the empress doesn't have, isn't showing any emotion. I feel like this empress is so mad. The empress is so mad. It's like, I don't have love for nothing. Like, I'm just gonna fight, cut, bite, bruise, whatever the fuck I gotta do. Like, cause I, I feel like, I feel like this empress has built up a lot of, of a lot of negative energy to the point where they want to explode and they're not going to have any love for the situation once they do like they're not emotionally connected to this situation i feel like this person is it's like they're put their soul is being pulled more and more away from whatever this situation is and that's what's creating and it's like the more the soul pulls back the more the more the anger rushes to the top and it's like, I'm pulling away because I'm so upset. The closer I get to you, I will pop. That's how hard once I pop off, it'll be, it'll be even worse. So I need to take a step back and take, I feel like somebody wants to take their emotions out of something. Yeah, I feel like, but whoever this person is coming in might be coming in to help, but also just kind of over like overpowering or overwhelming a situation. I feel like somebody wants to come in and help, but whoever this person is, hold on y'all. But yeah, somebody here is definitely trying to abuse their power. I feel like they mean well, but somebody means well, but it's like, you're just, I feel like something is very much overbearing. Somebody is moving too fast or coming in and this empress is like, um, no, I don't need your help. I don't, I don't want to talk to you. Like this person is taking their time coming in. It's like they're going to sneak up on you and then they're just going to rush in. And you're already going to be looking like, bitch, I was waiting for you to come in here and try some shit cut off. I feel like you're not really feeling, you're not finished with whoever this um whoever this person is. I feel like you're just, you're really mad right now. Yeah, you're trying to seek balance. It's like, it's like you got, I feel like this empress has energies coming from either way. As you can see, she's just kind of like here. And this person is coming in this way. They, they're just coming in and they're trying to over, they're trying to abuse their power. So this could be like a boss or somebody just comes in at the wrong time or something like that. Or it could, it could be family, it could be friends, it could be 
but I feel like this is more political because so this could be like in the work arena. Maybe somebody has been slowly but surely trying to talk to you, but they just they just haven't. But it's either any way you look at it for whoever this is for. It's like there is this empress here and it's like somebody is coming this way at him. And then you have this masculine energy that's coming over this way at him. This masculine energy is very argumentative because they're arguing with a few people. And I feel like the empress is just somebody that they're arguing with. The empress doesn't have any love or any emotional attachment. I feel like the empress is just really mad. And whoever this is, I feel like they're just coming in to help, you know, whoever just place yourself where, you know, where you need to. But it's like this person is just coming in. I feel like they mean well, but it's like the empress is like, no, um, fuck you, fuck you. Just no love across the board for anybody. If you don't, you better.